Jenny, you have been very vocal about wanting to have a baby. Yes. Yeah. Uh, but do you think you'll ever have a baby with David? Now I'm thinking I cannot. If there's one couple I don't give a shit about, it's Annie and Humpty Dumpty. Now I think I cannot. How I can when I'm egg and he egg? Now I think just 0.1% is possible. <laughs> and that's one of the things that the doctor said is, doesn't matter for a man, what is The doctor said I was a good candidate. She is young, so it's really dependent on the woman. I like how the producers don't even give a shit about Annie and Eggman. Like, damn. Um, once you have the vasectomy. I mean, if you're too late, how you take your baby, you know, to play like a, I mean, if well, you're 60 years Damn! damn! I'm not even gonna try to front. I'm Team Enfisa all the way. Fuck the Little Mermaid. Fuck Ursula. Fuck Chili Bowhead. Fuck Humpty Dumpty. Fuck them all, Enfisa. We don't need this shit. Yes, we do. Let's get it. I got that mango Moscato E40 water. Drink that shit up like it's water. 18% alcohol per volume. Sip, sip. Yo, what's up, squad? Today's video is going to be over the highly requested Enfisa versus Paula debate on the 90 Day Fiasco series. If you are new to the channel, please check out my other videos and hit that subscribe button slash notification bell to join the sauce squad and start receiving weekly bangers with that being said let's get to it Whoop. Oh, I wasn't giving you the finger Wait, just... and he finally coming to the realization that no one gives a flipping shit he's pointing at him they they need him oh if they need him they're gonna tell him I love how George is just acting oblivious to all of this it's like someone's in his mind telling him don't look left don't look left oh oh look straight look straight look straight Wait, wait, what? No, I just mentioned it, but don't give me the finger. I'm not doing anything yeah, I'm to gonna you. Give you the finger. No, I'm not For doing it. I'm actually looking at him to point and that someone is calling you. Don't be rude. Oh, you're doing... telling me to not be rude? Whatever. Look at the pot calling the kettle. Can you shut up? Yeah. Damn! God damn, if he's spinning straight bars right now. Let me show you a snippet of her album. Play it. No, you shut up. Don't give me the damn finger. What's wrong with you? I'm not doing anything to you. Do you want a male order, Brian? I'm planning to find someone that, like, better than her because she's not that pretty, though. Wait a minute. What just happened? I was just trying. No, it's just someone was calling George, and I was trying to be nice to tell George, and the other girl just give me the damn finger. Like, seriously? You know what's more offensive? Russ's hair. He looks like the missing Backstreet Boy that can't let go of the glory days. Literally, his hair just gave us all the finger. Y'all see that? Let me zoom in for y'all. Fuck you too, Russ. Fuck you too. Come on, girl, behave. You're gonna tell me to behave? Oh, you should have behaved last season. Just stuck with the hair. Oh, don't. don't. What? You're gonna try don't to hit yeah, me? Yeah, I am. Oh, try it. Try it. Seriously, try it. I get oh, you kiss. Oh, you kiss. Oh, you kiss. Why are you provoking me? me? I'm not, going to, I'm not, not even doing anything. Provoking. I'm not even looking at you. You're not oh, that yeah. interesting for me to look at. Oh, you. no. All of you're not looking at her. Who are you looking at? Who are you looking at? That's interesting. You talk about me all the time. Oh, my God. You wish. Do you want a male order, Brian? I'm planning to find someone that, like, better than her because she's not that pretty, though. <laughs> you wish. wish. I you don't wish. wish. Please, it girl. is the truth. Please, girl. Girl, I can take you down. But you know well, what? Do I don't want to go to that level. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! So, oh, you already build all I that need level. Water. I don't need to yeah, look please. at your face. <clears throat> I think we're gonna... Annie over here looking salty like, It was mid-time. It was mid-short time. Mid-time. Oh, please. Seriously, you just want to hit me? Just a little girl trying to hit me. What a joke. I'm not exactly sure why you're trash talking her while you're walking away, Paula. And Fisa was confronting you like 20 seconds ago. This is the exact reason why you guys are fighting. I know how you felt from last season. What, what did she do last season? Talk I'm planning to find someone that, like better than her because she's not that pretty, though. She's okay. You know, she says she don't want to go to that level. <laughs> Excuse me, I never said anything about her, did I? No. I love Enfisa solely for the fact that she's honest about her feelings and she won't hesitate to tell you. She may be a blunt gold digger, but what you see is what you get and there's beauty in that. Last season, Paola was rude to me, so I flipped her off because of that. She put on a fake front and to my face she was smiling, but behind my back she was just trash talking me. While I never said anything bad about her. 
I just, I don't like snakes. I, Damn! I don't like people like that. So I don't want to have anything to do with her. Oh my goodness, okay. She just came to me she to try to find me. She, she wanted to hit me. I'm gonna stand up next to her and try to hit me, girl. Have you ever seen me lifting? I hope not, Paula. I really hope not. I don't want to see you get lifted by Anfisa. She's got animosity. She's holding off. Pow tried to approach her on it, and she walked out of the room. Seriously, I can fight. The back. Last season, I'm just stuck with him. Oh, don't, don't. Oh, what? You're gonna try don't to hit yeah, me? Yeah, I am. But I don't gonna get to her damn level. I'm like, I can't believe this. Can you believe that? She didn't do anything. She just wants to fight, I think. I don't understand. Plus, I tried to go to the other room, like, to say hi, and I was actually, I wanted to apologize with her. And her attitude immediately, I say, I'm Fisa, and she just, like, walk away, and I'm like. So why'd they disappear? Why disappear? Can we disappear as well? Do we have, like, diva moments, too? This is the problem with Paula. If you have something to say, just say it to her face. If not, move on and stop slithering around. Honestly, I don't care about that. The couples and what they think, they should mind their own business and stay in their own lanes. She hit George, so well, I was surprised she stand up to me because... If she hits George and he's like three times your size, what makes you think she's scared to give you that whooping? Well, last after time? the tell all last time, she saw like... You and I understand saying, her, like, but I'm gonna ugly. Tell you, I was joking. You were joking? That's the exact excuse I used as a kid right before I got that parental ass whooping. I mean, even Chantel sniffs the bullshit. I think, okay, I, yeah. I was joking. I didn't like how Pal went in on, on Fisa last year about her appearance. Thank God. Thank God, God a tea. I mean, you can judge somebody by their actions and what they do, and that's your opinion, but when you judge somebody on their appearance, that's so shallow. It wasn't the right of me, like, actually say, to make those comments. But, like, look, I never came to her in the way she came to me. Mainly because you like to talk behind her back, and Hafisa wants you to say it to her face. So it's like, like the <clears throat> finger and then trying to hit me? Like, come on. We no. came in with the, the perspective of, hey, we'd like to open up to everyone. And unfortunately, no, we had the wrong that's... perspective. No, listen. And we came into this in the right... Up, like no, you stop George, interrupting me. Up. Stop interrupting me. Don't talk to my wife like that. Oh. What the f I like how Anfisa is just sitting there like she knows she's about to win this duel after summoning her strongest card. Okay, George, 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 George. Oh, okay, George. Okay, George. Okay, George. Okay, George. Yeah, you're sitting back there letting your wife stand up for you. What the fuck? George. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, you, you say bye. You say bye. Okay. Everyone have a seat. I don't talk to you like that. You don't talk at all, George. You don't say anything. You let your wife say everything. And you don't? Oh, I stand up for myself. Don't talk to my wife like that. What the fuck? Okay, George. Stand up for yourself as well. Let's go. Like, really? Two aggressive people in here? Seriously? I wasn't wearing the right shoes. Two aggressive people and a dumb from Colombia. Damn! God damn! Get in, Fisa. This is what I mean. She won't hesitate to say it to your face. Two aggressive people in this room, they think that it's right to actually hit people. I want to punch a bitch in the face. In my opinion, it's pretty clear cut who took the dub. One couple is still on stage and one couple is walking away. Now, I'm not saying don't walk away from the fight, but if you're talking behind someone's back, you best be prepared to stand your ground. With that being said, comment below whether you're Team Anfisa or Team Paula, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Is this what you expect? Is this what you expect? Is this shit what you planned? Was this shit how you saw it? I'm just asking. I mean, I just, I just can't understand. I mean, maybe I'm tripping. Okay, maybe I'm tripping. Here, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I thought too much while I was gone.